you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee in a match. Just so wise. Bruce Lee enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC champion. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, here is Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Oh, beautiful technique on that straight punch. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. He's already landed several in this round, and the damage is really starting to take its toll. Yeah, it's really starting to take its toll, and you watch the opponent walking gingerly on his leg, and one big tell that you're starting to really do well with your leg kicks is when your opponent starts to switch stances. Right. Watch for a stance switch very soon. Patented front kick there by Lee. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Nice shot there by the champ. Oh, roundhouse kick. Style points on that one. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up for me now. Single leg, take down. Jab snaps the head back. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind him. A lot of times, people throw singular strikes. Not this, gentlemen. This man is stringing four, five, six in a row. What a great job. Pretty good head kick there. Under three minutes to go in round one. Got the single collar tie. And they separate after exiting the clinch. Throws that teep. Lands a good series of kicks here. Oh, that's a nice strike. Lee gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Body shot there. Got to the clinch, controlled the posture, and lands some big knees from the close. This beautiful kick lands. Well, he is a tactician. He does not discriminate when it comes to his weapons. There's a sidekick. That sidekick can go to the legs or to the body. What a technique. Oh, and another leg kick lands. And I assure you, there is no microphone on those shorts. That is flesh on flesh, bone on bone. Another debilitating strike to the leg. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. What a great job getting that kick to the target. 90 seconds to go. Oh, what a kick. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Swing and a miss by Lee. Nice positional control here. 
Postures up now and lands a vicious head strike. Oh, reverses the position there. Nice transition by Lee. Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. Yes, yeah, smart adjustment. Yep. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Lee. Oh, staying busy from top position. He lands another ground strike there. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Oh, well-timed with that team. Wow, another nice combination there. He's got the flow state going tonight. Oh, he's in rhythm, John. It's like the music's playing in his head, and he is just salsa dancing all up on his opponent's face. I mean, a jab, right hand, uppercut. Everything he throws lands, and it lands with vicious intent. That's a big strike right there. Final seconds here. Oh, he's got hand skills for days. Beautiful combination of punches to the head. Second round, straight ahead. That's relax. Excellent work with those strikes. Combinations we train in the gym are perfect. Keep that going. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two here. All right, next round is now underway. Do you see any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put this to the out. Even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, he gets tagged there. Nice combination to the head. All right, doing work with the jab. Ooh. At one point, when you adjust and see these head kicks landing over the top, he's throwing these punches in combination, really dictate the pace of his opponent. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the ball. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Colby Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Keep your hands up. Another nice kick there. Solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. Let kick lands. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start checking kicks. Oh, side kick. Well done. Pretty significant well to the left side. Leading with that right punch. Just over three minutes now to go in round two. Nice kick. Nice crack there. He closes the distance beautifully. He's got a single collar tie. Hook in the clinch there is good by Lee. And that one certainly found the target. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Leg kick is true. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pot. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Two minutes now to go in round two. Just turning his hip over into the leg kick. Beautiful 
double jab lands. Oh, he's staying busy here, connecting with a barrage of punches. And the front kick is there. Nice job by Lee. He's got good leg kicks. There it is. Oh, high kick lands flush. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and really a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the octagon. To go home and admire your work, it doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to the right now and firing up the video to look at beauty in action. And he was a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Big shot to the head. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. More strikes to the head. Big inside kick. 30 seconds now to go on the round. Ooh, what a punch. And he lands it. Fifteen seconds. Man, his jab is good. There it is. And that's been and kicked out. It's home up top. All right, gets inside. Oh, oh. Gets the single collar tie here. Stop. All right, that's the end of round number two. Uh, take a seat, bud. Breathe. Relax. Get some water and listen up. You felt his power. You're fine. Everything is good, okay? He won the strike in that round, right? All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, I mean, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. You ready? You ready? Go. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the score. This is what happens when you get two very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next round. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Oh, nice. All right, so now his body language really starting to change and the bruises starting to accumulate on that side. I mean, you're looking at it, right? When you can visibly see the damage on the body, you know that the work has been done. What a beautiful game plan put together by this team. Oh, that strike to the body, man. Good jab. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other up. It's been tremendous. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ, following the game plan, and it's working. Nice head kick. Three minutes to go in round three. Clipped him with the right hand there. Oh, lands another hook. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Big knee lands right to the front of midsection. Lee's pretty swollen now in that jaw area. It doesn't appear to be affecting him all that much, but he's absorbed a lot of strikes to the head. Got to figure out a way to raise the guard and be more defensively sound. Let's get busy with those hands now, man. Come on, let's... So we have crossed the midpoint in this one. Another powerful 
kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Bleeding now, nasty cut on his nose. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Ooh, big shot lands. That is a damaging kick that lands. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Oh, pinpoint strike lands there, and not going to help the swelling upstairs. I love this accuracy, this ability to get his shots to the target right away. And you see it in the swelling that is forming on his opponent's face. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, nice right hand. Great defensive skills. He blocked that punch. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that's lead the dance. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. 20 seconds left. Well-placed kick there by Lee. Hook lands. Oh. All right, three rounds down, potentially two more to go. We are headed to the championship round. Nice work out there. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cutman will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. Well, if you're the replay guy, a lot to like in that previous round. A lot of damage being inflicted. Yeah, I mean, and look at the swelling now, John. He wasn't doing what he needed to do to move his head, and he's paying for it. You cannot allow for an elite-level mixed martial artist to connect at that rate and think that you will not be wearing the damage. He's wearing it now. I'm interested to see what changes he makes to give himself an opportunity. All right, here we go. The tension is palpable. Fourth round is underway. You've got a thing or two to say about these championship rounds. The fourth round is easily the hardest round in fighting. You're so used to fighting up to three. You got to get back off of that stool. And this is a real test of your will and desire to run a fight. Oh, Superman punch is good. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Beautiful leg kick lands. Good jab there by the champion. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Oh, man. Yet another huge kick lands. Oh, the head kick lands. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Oh, thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent. Lifted a little bit, trying to stay upright. But man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Get those combinations going. Hold those hands. Just misses with a left hook there. Well, in case of pick your poison here, if you drop the elbow defensively to lessen the body damage, you open yourself up upstairs. He is in some serious trouble now. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. Trying to kick the leg out. 
Three minutes to go. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not had any answer for these body shots, and now you see the visible damage. Well, his coaches are wondering, where's the defenses? We worked on this. We knew this would be an attack that they would come with. Why are you not doing what we've trained? He's got to change something, man. He's got to tuck that elbow. He's got to roll and turn. He cannot continue to take these body shots. Well, an incredible fight thus far. Both fighters look like they could be finished at any time. If you wondered about the heart on either side, that question was answered to Nothing. There are no more questions in regards to these two fighters. Both of these men have been hurt. Both of these men are swollen. They're bloody. They're both, even though them, they're both willing and ready to continue this fight. Trying to get the knees going. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to keep that elbow tight and throw punches with his free hand. Just missed with the leg kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, back and forth we go. Stay on that cut for me. Oh, nice jab there by Lee. And there's a takedown attempt. Another huge kick. Pretty good straight punch there by Lee. And they separate. Well, his mobility hasn't necessarily been compromised, but his offense has been muted by those thigh kicks that continue to do damage. Yeah, these leg kicks are, are, are beautiful. They, they spoke about their game plan. They openly told us this guy does not check kicks. It has proven true. And right now, he's getting very close to winning this fight. Fourth round here, less than a minute to go. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. Just out of range with that strike. Oh, nice knee. Nice ball. Huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. It's a big knee. Oh. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Oh! Oh! Oh, my goodness. He's trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Outstanding oh, round. Do you believe it? Another five minutes coming up. All right, buddy, take a seat. Deep breath. Slow that up. Awesome, man. Your striking is working superb. Everything you're putting out there is landing. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides here. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Fifth and final round, fourth cover. All right, here we go with the next round. We'll see if he can pick up where he left off. No reason really to change anything when he threw more often than not he was landing. He was landing over and over again, and that is just a testament of the accuracy and the striking acumen of this fight. Nice combination of kicks. Nice straight right, Lance. Both fighters starting to open up a little bit. Oh, he lands another crushing kick to his opponent's leg. He escaped, committed with that weapon, and this might be over soon. Yeah, he is not kicking to the leg. He's kicking through the leg, and you see his opponent limping now all around the octagon. Oh, the bruising on that calf, champ. That's not good. Hey, take your cans off. Tell me to check it. I mean... We got to go back to pandemic fighting where they could just hear the coaching because, man, he has not checked one kick and he's paying for it now. He lands a switch knee. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. 
Ooh, got to be careful taking too many of those leg kicks. Oh, that cut on his nose is only getting worse. Not good. Oh, these are some impactful knees he is throwing, and I guess until his opponent adjusts, might as well keep throwing them. He's going to keep going to the well. Why would he change it? His opponent has not been able to figure out these knees. Lee's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Look at that great work to the body from the clinch. Push kick there to the body. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Well, at this point, he is black and blue all over. High-level damage, and I wouldn't be surprised, actually, even though it's body damage, to see the ref call in the dark. It's almost over. John, this fight's almost over. At any point now, they can stop it. The doctor steps into the octagon. I believe this fight's going to be called off. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Man, that cut is just nasty. So if you're the guy who cleans up the canvas, are you, like, rooting for this so you have a job to do? I mean, you want to do less as possible. You want to just sit there and watch. The reality is, though, he's got some work in front of him after this fight. And so does the cut, man. We are bloodied and battered here in the octagon. Oh, nice punch from the clinch by Lee. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Oh, man, how many leg kicks can one man take? I mean, I think this is it. If he takes many more of these kicks, his night is going to be over. Oh, nice. Takedown defense is there. Final round, final minute. What a fight it has been. And hard for the referee to get involved when damage is being doled out on both sides. I mean, it's so evenly matched. These guys have done such a great job of staying in the fight. There have been many moments in this fight where you thought one of them just did not have enough. Look at all the blood. Look at all the bruising on these two fighters. These guys have done a tremendous job. This is a fight of the night candidate. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Well, that calf is a new shade of purple right now. I'm not sure he's going to be able to stand up much longer. I mean, it's swollen, it's bruised, it's all beat up. He takes one or two more, this fight's going to be stopped. Lee gets hit with a kick. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. 15 seconds remain in the round. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Now he's got the single collar in the clinch. Well, what a title fight it was. What a showcase it was for this division. But at the end of the day, the champion just did a little bit more, and you got to think he gets the nod, right? I believe it was the championship experience that allowed him to push through in those spots that he needed to in order to keep his championship. I agree with you, J.A. I think he keeps his belt. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon.
mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight. And given this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about, you know he's going to get everyone's best shot.